Hey, welcome to the Motley Fool's Crunch Time series where we scout out a single company from the story to the opportunities and risks. Time to take a closer look at the most important brand in the semiconductor industry that most people have never heard of, ASML. First, my prediction. I think ASML is very likely to beat the market over the next five years and beyond. Let's dig in and talk about why. ASML is one of the most important companies in the semiconductor industry. Its lithography machines enable chip makers to print the most advanced chips in the world. While it's not the only lithography machine provider, it's certainly the leader in the space, and its extreme ultraviolet machines, EUV, are the only ones that can print the most advanced chips powering data centers, AI, the cloud, and increasingly newer technology. These machines are extremely complex, took billions of dollars and multiple decades to develop, giving ASML a massive technological advantage over the competition. But the company also earns significant revenue from ASML on-site employees that many of its largest customers, like Taiwan Semiconductor, rely on to keep their ASML machines up and running. The bottom line is if those lithography machines are not running, then the semiconductor manufacturing lines are not operating. While parts of the chip industry remain in a cyclical downturn, the secular story is one of growth. Demand for chips for the cloud, AI, machine-to-machine -machine integration, mobile computing, and a litany of other applications are growing as the world's people and machines become more connected and the global middle class population continues to expand. Putting some numbers to it, ASML expects that its customers will increase the number of wafer exposures on its base of installed machines from around 525 million last year to over 900 million in 2030. That's more than 71% growth in just over a half decade. Most importantly, the company isn't counting on those leading edge EUV machines to do the heavy lifting. It expects its DUV machines, which really are the workhorse of the chip industry, to continue driving most of that volume and the volume growth. Let's talk risks. The semiconductor industry is cyclical. Despite the exceptionally strong growth from accelerated computing like the cloud and AI, big parts of it have been stagnant or even down in demand in recent years. At some point, we're going to see the current high growth parts of the industry slow, and we could see the whole industry take a breather during periods of global economic weakness. The stock looks like it trades for a reasonable valuation today at about 24 times operating cash flow, but that's also at near record cash flow levels. A downturn in demand could make today's reasonable price look wildly expensive. There's also geopolitical risk with ASML, which counts on Taiwan Semiconductor as a major customer and China as one of its most important markets. Sanctions have already impacted its ability to sell into and support some of its customers in China. And if we see a trade escalation between the U.S. and China, that could affect it even more, even though it's worth mentioning that ASML is not an American company. Okay, let's talk my prediction. ASML is one of the most important companies in one of the most important industries on earth. The secular tailwinds are exceedingly strong, and few tech companies have the level of defensible moat in its IP that ASML has, not to mention such at a critical place in the industry's supply chain. Now, there's cyclical risk with a business like this, but over the long term, I think ASML is going to give us more of what we've seen for years and years, and that is it being an exception exceptional market beating investment. All right, let's wrap this up. At The Motley Fool, your comments make us all smarter. Please comment with your own research and insights about ASML and tell us what stock you want to see us tackle next. Go to fool.com forward slash invest to receive the top 10 best stocks to buy now.